Hello, this is Svetlana Shapitsina and in this tutorial I will show how to set up development environment for creating application with Angular file 0.8. First of all we need to run terminal, right click on Windows icon, run, CMD and we have an open. And I, uh, also we have possibility to install application. It's called uh, Power CMD and I already did it and you will see how convenient to use it like terminal and here it is I will hide first one and uh, uh, on, di on disk C in folder up I created a folder for my future application it's far up and uh, now I need to install uh, Ruby installer uh, in order to use SAS compiler compass for uh, compiling code from SCSS to CSS and here it is Ruby, Ruby installer for Windows I already did it after that uh, in terminal I need to run command uh, for installing gem gem and enter and you can find more information about Ruby gems on this website after that I need to install SAS and here and uh, here we have command that we can copy and with this uh, PowerCMD application I can use shortcut Ctrl V and enter it takes some time everything fine and after that I open website human and uh, here uh, I can use uh, this command for installing you but uh, I will better open discover discovering generators and find generator for application that we need it's gulp angular fire here it is and I have it open on github and uh, here you have all, inform all information how to use it and first command npm install globally this command uh, dash g means that you need to install it just once I copy it and paste it takes some time but it just once and after that after it will be installed I will install generator also globally I copy it but un unfortunately uh, I cannot uh, use all commands in this application even if I insert and click enter okay this command work here works here and next uh, I skip making new directory since I already did it and uh, in order to check if my directory is empty I just click dir, type dir and enter and you can see that it has uh, no uh, zero files after that I use command io gulp angular fire and name of my application and uh, I will use it on standard terminal 
and uh, first of all I need to reach my folder I type cd two dots two times and then uh, my folder up in which a uh, folder for application uh, cd fire I don't have IntelliSense here cd fire up OK, and I cannot use Ctrl V, paste, and I want to choose name just up. I want it, for example, uppercase, enter. And now uh, we need to answer some questions, and uh, first I choose advanced mode and uh, here I need to switch I use Alt J K for moving around and uh, then uh, space and I need to turn off all these modules and for turning off I use space button and after that enter it's angular fire by, by default enter and here I need jQuery 2 ok known and here UI router and of course foundation it takes some time and here we don't have IntelliSense and uh, in power CMD for example if I click if I type CD and then I want to reach my uh, folder I type CD fire and you see I have IntelliSense here up like this okay take some time Maybe because we're on another terminal, it doesn't want to work. It takes a while all this uh, setting up, uh, uh, setting up all uh, this environment. But uh, we need to do it just once, and in future, for creating an application, we will save this time. successfully and finally we did it and now all we need to do to open WebStorm and uh, open our folder up and uh, here is far up I choose it and click OK Everything fine. An application, and if I want to see what shortcuts I use, I click Ctrl Alt S and type presentation. Like this, and choose 
presentation assistant apply ok and I can show all shortcuts that I use and uh, here first of all I want to hide terminal and uh, I need I want to open I will do it manually to show uh, how it works in application we have a uh, file index and when we click alt n and type index uh, we have several of them so uh, we need uh, to find a right one it's uh, far up up here it is and after uh, after our styles Uh, we need to add reference to foundation and uh, it will be before, sorry, before our styles with age jump it's easy and I type bower components I have intelligence and then foundation CSS and slash foundation CSS. Okay, we did it. And uh, now we can run from terminal command. I have a shortcut for this GLP. Okay, one more. GLS, sorry. And then white space, it's command gulp serve to run our application and we have it open, we have everything ready for us and after that we just need to set up some environment in WebStorm I click Ctrl Alt S and here I find JavaScript In libraries, I need to choose Bower, and now I will delete some components. Uh, Angular mock. failed somehow Angular R we have 0 0.8 doesn't want Now uh, we uh, close settings and uh, uh, we need to open Bower JSON in far up. Here it is, and we need to delete Angular mock independencies. And after that, uh, we open settings again in in Bower. I need to 
choose install angular it takes some time here it is angular and specify version delete this one Aldel and it fails somehow Angular delete now it's fine but like this and we'll try again install angular specify version install package now successfully after that we need to find angular animate Angular Animate Specify Version install successfully after Angular Animate Angular UI Router. Here it is. Install successfully and Angular Foundation. and fine and uh, now all we need to do to run our terminal I will close uh, Google JSON and um, in terminal I give a command uh, Bower Bower install angular file and save And uh, here we choose 0.3 4 enter and everything fine GLS some time and here it is and uh, that's it for today thank you bye bye